Welcome back to the channel, y'all. In this video, I want to share with y'all some more updates that I hear that's going on with the stimulus and what's going on with unemployment and stuff. Because I had some people to comment on my last video. Now, uh, some of the stuff that I talk about, I be referring to some of the stuff, the stuff that I hear about the stimulus check. Now, me personally, I told you guys I'd be shocked if, the, if we actually do get another stimulus check. I was going to be kind of shocked. Now, that being said, I'm still going to be shocked if we actually get another 1,200 round stimulus check. But they claim it's going to happen September September 30th, which is next month. Because they saying they got to pass another bill because the government is going into shutdown mode or whatever. You know, I don't know too much about the shutdown mode. But what I do know, I know Americans, American people need help out here. A lot of people lost their jobs. Some of their jobs went out when the COVID-19 first hit and they done that shutdown. Well, a lot of stuff didn't never open back up no more. So some people went clean out of business for good. That being said, now when September 30th come, I don't know if they really going to pass a bill. Could be just talk. Uh, just like they've been playing us all, all along, you know. I don't know if the government really going to shut down. That could be just talk, too. We're just going by some of the nicks and pieces of what we hear, you know. Now, for the unemployment, some states, some states, some of the states that I knew about, they only get unemployment for, like, three weeks, you know. Some people get it four weeks, um. Some states only, some people ain't even accepting an executive order or whatever it is, you know. Um, but I do know that having, that's the, some of the money still coming out in the CARES Act, you know. That could be what's going on. But from my understanding, there haven't been no bill that's still unemployment. See, that's why Trump, Donald Trump did his, the executive order to stay in unemployment for five or four weeks or whatever, the, how many weeks it is, you know. He did that so people could get extended unemployment boost. But actually, unless they got money from the CARES Act still, there really ain't been no specific bill that really can extend unemployment. Because there have not been no bill passed that extend unemployment. That's why Donald Trump had to step in and do executive order. Congress couldn't come together on nothing. See, they didn't care. The Republicans wanted $200 a week unemployment boost. The Democrats wanted $600 a week unemployment boost still. So they bickering back and forth. Couldn't neither party come together in Congress to pass a bill. That's why Donald Trump had to step his foot in and do the executive order because Nancy Pelosi and then Mitch McConnell and them couldn't agree to pass a package. See? So unemployment is out for most states are getting three hundred dollars a week. Their unemployment boost, and the reason why I'm saying three is actually supposed to be four, but uh, what it is three because a lot of states didn't have the extra hundred dollars to give to people. You know, it's actually supposed to be four hundred dollars a week, but the federal government only giving three, and your state got to get the other extra hundred. But it's claiming a lot of states don't have the extra hundred dollars to give, you know. So I'm just going, <laughs> I'm just going by the news that I'm hearing that you know, uh, way I get it, you know. Now, from my understanding, that that when Donald Trump put in the executive order, that only lasts for four um, or five weeks or whatever it is, vice versa, you know. And it ain't lasts until December thirty first. Uh, because do it will never run out. Unless states just doing that anyway, you know. But there haven't been no package put in place for the last of December thirty first. That's the point. That's why they want them to come together so they can make a package so it can stand out to December thirty first. So I'm saying guys that there ain't been no package on it. See ain't been nothing done about it yet. That's why they bickering back and forth. Like, they're fighting each other, and that's why Donald Trump had to step in and do the executive order, because they can't agree on a bill. 
That's the point. They can't agree on a bill. Even the Federal Reserve was stepping in because the Republican Party, the House, the Democrat, the Senate couldn't come together to create a bill for the people. They're just bickering back and forth, which they're doing the same thing right now, playing games, playing mind games with us, because it's all planned, because really, Congress didn't care. I told you guys, they didn't care no way, and they still don't care. If they really cared, they would already had a bill on them. They don't care. And the only true one that cared was Donald Trump. Because he did a second order. If it weren't for that, you wouldn't even be getting unemployment now. See? So I don't know what kind of news some of you guys hearing out there, but if it weren't for Donald Trump doing an executive order, <laughs> unemployment boost wouldn't be happening now. You know? It wouldn't be none because it ran out under the CARES Act, from my understanding. Now, if I'm correct, it ran out July 31st. That's what I was thinking anyway. Now, maybe I'm hearing incorrect news or so. But from what I'm thinking, it ran out July 31st. So, if it wasn't for Donald Trump, believe me, y'all would not have no unemployment if it weren't for the executive order. So that's the way I'm getting it. And that's why I come back and tell you guys, they said by December 31st, they're, they're trying to extend it by December 31st with the next package. But the next package haven't been passed yet. And the Republicans want to do a skinny bill. Democrats want, I think it's $3 trillion, but they try, they're talking to come down to $2.4 trillion or something like that. Which is still, the, the Republicans don't want to go that high in spending. So either way, Donald Trump said if this $1,200 stimulus ain't in there, he's not going to sign off on it. So, so that's a guaranteed stimulus check for all the American people that's eligible for it anyway. So anyway, y'all hit me in the comments, man. I'm going by the news that I get. <laughs> I'm out, man. <laughs> and I'll see you guys on the next.